I haven't done a haul video since like last year and I have so many clothes that I bought and I haven't worn yet. So I thought, let's do a haul video right now because all these clothes have just been waiting for it. I'm going to start off with H&M first. So these are all the clothes I bought from H&M. The first thing I got are these super cute workout shorts. They're really, really nice. They're a nice blue color. They're super thin and really comfortable. They even have an inside pocket if you want to put your house key or anything inside. So yeah, I bought these in the workout section of H&M. I would highly recommend these. They're super flexible, really, really thin, really nice. These are the second pair of shorts that I bought there. Um, I love these. They're really comfortable. Um, they hang above right above the knee and they're like a cute beige color and you can make them smaller or shorter if you want to adjust them or not. But yeah, they have a lot of pockets, which is really nice and I really like these. And last pair of shorts, I absolutely adore these. They're such a pretty pink color. They have a thick waistband and elastic so you can tie them up, but they're sweat shorts. But the nice thing about these also is that even though they're sweat shorts, they're not thick. Cause you know how some of them are really thick and really fuzzy and they make you really hot? These aren't, these have no fuzz, they're just straight up sweats. And they're really, really nice, really nice. They don't make you sweat, they don't make you hot because they're really thin, which is a major plus. They have the two front pockets and then they have the back pocket. This is a tank top I bought there. It's like a really pretty turquoise seafoam green color. Just a classic tank top, pocket in the front. I just needed extra clothes because I don't really have a lot of tank tops or a lot of just regular things I could throw on. So I thought this would be a good collection to it. This shirt, um, I love this shirt, super nice. I bought this on the discount rack, it was only $4. It's black and it just has um, yellow palm trees all around it. Super vibey, I love it. It's really thin too, it's a really thin shirt. You can practically see through it, which is nice. So it's not heavy or a lot of fabric. I just thought it was something different and I loved it. I have yet to wear most of these clothes and I have yet to wear this one, but I see us having a good time, you know, maybe like a club fit or something, I don't know. So the funny thing about this is I actually bought this in Claremont in this little like thrift store and, but it's an H&M shirt. So I really love this. I love stripes. I love stripes so much. This is white and burgundy stripes and I just thought it was super cute. The last shirt I bought, I love it. I love it. It's a pretty like beige sand color, super simple, pocket in front. But the thing about this that I love is that it's thin. I love thin clothing because I sweat a lot and I get really hot really fast. So the thinner the better. And this is like loincloth on your body. I love it. It's so comfortable, it's so comfortable. It's like one of those really, really nice, like you know those pajama shirts? that you absolutely love because they're so comfortable and they're just like nice to the touch. This is one of those shirts, but it looks nice. Last shirt that I bought there is this pretty like yellow tie-dye shirt and it has those like Drake hands like this. Back says less Monday, more fun. I just thought it was a cute shirt and I love the color of it. I never really liked the color yellow, which is really weird. I always thought it was like such an ugly color, but now I like, love it because I've been so happy and so full of positivity and just everything and I just think everybody should have yellow in their collection. It's such a bright vibrant color and it just generates a lot of happiness for me and I love it. And the last thing that I bought from H&M was this super like sleek just regular gray sweater. I was thinking of cutting it in half to make it like a cute crop top sweater. Um, I'm not sure yet. I haven't done it yet but it's like it the material in this is like, I don't want to say like wet bodysuit because that like feels uncomfortable, but it's like super snug, like super like just form fitting, but it's really nice material. I got this on the clearance rack for only $7. So if I make it into a crop top and make it into something different, I will definitely show you guys because I want to do something with this. I don't want to just keep it gray and just boring you know so these are my forever 21 clothes i have so many but we're gonna get through these these are the first shorts that i got from forever 21 
They're super cute right above the knee shorts. They're like a really pretty forest green, like a really deep green. I love them though. Super comfortable, a lot of pockets. Well, actually extra pockets. But yeah, they're super nice. I have yet to wear them. The first pair of pants that I bought there are these pretty beige tan, like joggers actually. They have the elastic band on the waist. And they also have the elastic bands down here on your ankles. Um, again, it's adjustable, which, it, but that's one of the main things that I love about Forever 21 is that most of their pants are like adjustable. So you can like fit them to your waist size. So my last pair of pants that I bought there <sighs> hold a very dear place in my heart. They're pink and they have holes in them right above the knees, but it kind of looks like patchwork. I don't know if you guys can tell the detail. They're super nice though, like super beautiful. And again, elastic on the waist and adjustable. I love these so much. I have a very near and dear place for these in my heart. So now for my shirts. So the first shirt that I got, this isn't really a shirt, it's kind of like an overthrow, is this super cute like baseball denim washed type of thing. Super simple, just something quick to throw over anything that I need to throw over or add an extra pizzazz to my outfit. I like it, something new. This shirt, I love this shirt. It's actually like a flannel shirt super pretty super fall um the rest from here on out is like super fall i love fall and i need a more fall clothes on the sides actually it unbuttons so if you want to add a little extra flare or anything and have the sides unbuttoned that would be cool it's really comfortable as well i don't know what it's made out of but the fabric on this is heaven like heaven it feels like a blanket so the next shirt that I bought from Forever 21 is this really pretty brown color. It's like brown and black, but the details on it look like a handkerchief. I can't wait to wear this. This is a look. This with any outfit is a look. The last shirt that I bought, I actually found this on the clearance rack and it was only $3. It's one of those t-shirt dresses that are like super long and it's really pretty green, really pretty like olive green color and the, sh the sleeves are super short. I only got it for three bucks, three dollars. That's unbelievable. And there's no tears in it, there's no holes. It's a super nice shirt and I can't wait to wear it. So the first jacket that I bought, um, it's not actually like a jacket. I don't know what you would call it, honestly, but it's a flannel and a hoodie knitted together. Again, really fall. I absolutely fell in love with it. And it buttons up, but the sides unzip. Like that one shirt that, I, um, that one shirt, that one flannel that I have that unbuttons, this one unzips on the sides. It's really nice though. Really well made. The second one that I thought was on the clearance rack as well. This one was only about, I believe, $7. Super simple, but I don't have anything tie-dye. And I've always wanted tie-dye. And I don't know why I don't have anything tie-dye. So I was thinking of like cutting it into a crop top as well. And I wanted something really colorful in my wardrobe, so I bought it. I know this was in a recent video. I can't remember what video it was in, but I'm gonna put it in here anyways because I bought it from Forever 21, so. It's the watercolor jacket. The only thing I don't like about it is that it has a kiss in the back. No offense to any kiss people, but this is just so random. It's just there. But I mean, that's what you get from Forever 21. Sometimes you find really cute stuff and then it's like, why but i love forever 21 but sometimes i don't know <laughs> it's one of those really nice sweaters that it's just like a blanket inside and it's simple. this i actually found on the clearance rack it was only three dollars and it was way longer than this because it was super big but i cut it into a crop top and it turned into a look this one was in my get ready with me the one i just posted love it really fall it's two-tone you guys didn't really get to see it because I showed it off super fast, but it's brown plaid on top and then it's just bleached on the bottom. Super orange, really fall. Then the most bestest, mestest, statistic, favorite things that I ever bought from Forever 21. This is a velvet shirt. Look how, oh, it looks so beautiful on camera. This is a brown velvet shirt that I bought. And ooh, look at that shine. Look at that shine. This is so beyond beautiful. 
and I love it and when I laid eyes on it I was like I need to get it just can we just appreciate this real quick then my most favorite thing that I ever bought the these are actually men clothes too because usually I only see these in the women's section but they made some for men velvet jogger sweats and I fell in love can we just appreciate the green color of this and it's so shiny in the way oh I fell in love wearing these is so comfortable this is like somebody dipped me in honey rolled me in sugar threw me into the oven and baked me into the most beautiful pumpkin pie you have ever met these are beautiful these changed my life forever so the last thing that I bought is actually from Zara um, it's this beautiful this was on sale actually I went during their sales because I don't shop in Zara because they're way too expensive like super expensive and like I'm not that bougie to be spending like $100 for a shirt like so I never go in there I don't even look at it I just walk past it but they were having a sale and I don't know how much I bought this for actually it was like really cheap though suede baby blue jacket really nice really nice in the inside is camo and it's green and pink yeah I got some money but I really don't I don't want really have any money but I can pretend I do I really hope you guys enjoyed this haul if you guys want to see more hauls let me know because I'm constantly always buying stuff which is probably a bad habit that I need to change but anyways I'm gonna try to put all the links and everything down in the description box below in case you guys want to look at anything or purchase anything I can't promise you that I'm gonna find everything because some of these things I bought a while back but I will honestly try with every ounce of my being to do it for you guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share. If you guys have any questions about any of these, just let me know. Um, for anybody wondering, I bought most of these clothes in an extra small or a small, occasionally a medium, just because I'm a super small person in general. I'm only 5'3", so all the clothes that I buy are super small. If you guys have any more questions or anything you guys want to ask me about any of these clothes or anything on this video, just let me know and I'll be more than gladly to help you. So thank you for watching and have an amazing day. I don't really think I have a shopping problem, but I just love clothes.